if that's all right with Noble Lane. Um, so I hope... Find it. Cast sample, cast sample. Yep, Noble Lane. It's another um, it's another load on the um, alcohol. That's 57%. Yeah, so let's let's ramp it up to something a bit higher. So um, I was talking before about Silk Road and how it had uh, it had the the benefit of virgin American oak and all of the spice that came from that. Well, this one has virgin French oak, and so it's probably as close to the cognac tradition as we're going to get in terms of what we've done here. So um, virgin French oak influence. It's also had time in bourbon cask and it's had some time in botrytis so the dessert white wine style that you might associate with noble one um or you know the de bordley botrytis semion style yep really, so really, 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 yep, really sweet stuff all contributing uh in different ways to this delicious whiskey so this one was a gold medalist at the World Whiskies Awards in 2023. Uh, it's at the uh, Royal Australian Spirit Awards last year. It was not only a gold medal winner, but it was the cask strength category winner for Australia. Um, and it's quite unusual for an Australian whiskey in using the Metritis cask. So, uh, and the combination, in fact, I don't think anyone else in Australia has produced a whiskey that has virgin French oak and um, bourbon cask and botrytis all brought together so beautifully. Um, oh, my God, that's smooth on the palate. Mm. It lit my face on fire. Um, yes. Very different again. Oh, yeah. The way that I, I describe it to people, it's a bit like having a like a milfoil, like a vanilla cake, or um, it's definitely a dessert style of whiskey. Um, Glen Morangi do the Nectar Door, which is um, they use the Botrytis or Saturn casks. So it's a similar kind of flavor profile to that, but the Virgin French Oak is a little bit more uh, forward in this expression. And it's also got a lot of, a lot of the vanilla coming through from the bourbon casks. This would also be interested, um, good for a newbie into whiskey, given how smooth right. it is. Yeah, I mean, yeah. It's, it's full strength. There's no, no denying that it's the um, full 57%, but mm. given how smooth it is, yeah, I'd be guessing if, if you're a newbie and you want to want to have something that's got a bit of punch mm. to it. Um, mm. I, I, I would just wish I was richer. That way I could send you a check and you could send me four bottles and I could sit there and voluntarily pontificate and muse mm. over the four bottles. Unfortunately, I'm, yeah. I've got kids eating me into the poverty line. Well, something to aspire to and, um, yeah, I'm sure we can, I'm sure we can work something out. 